Floyd McNew. I'm a graduate student, a doctoral student here at Vanderbilt University. I work with Gene LaBeouf on a uh, National Science Foundation funded project looking at the environmental implications of engineered nanomaterials. So the same characteristics that make engineered nanomaterials um, desirable for applications of technology uh, also raise concerns about um, ecological as well as human health. So uh, our project then is focused on uh, how the, the implications these nanomaterials then have on the environment. Um, so much of the work I've done so far to date at Vanderbilt uh, has been on uh, custom building a quartz crystal microbalance, uh, thermally insulated, so that I can actually look at the interactions between the aqueous versions of these engineered nanomaterials. We're focusing mainly on carbonaceous engineered nanomaterials. Um, but anyway, so I can, I can use, I can look at the interactions between these aqueous versions of engineered nanomaterials and soil organic matter. And hopefully this will allow us then uh, to gain a better understanding of the fate and transport these engineered nanomaterials uh, will have in the environment, as well as lead to better improvements as far as uh, wastewater treatment and things like that. So I've worked very closely with a group here at Vanderbilt called Vanderbilt Institute of Nanoscale Science and Engineering, uh, VINS, and they provide us with a top-notch uh, analytical equipment um, specifically to measure things to, about engineered nanomaterials and any type of nanomaterials. And they have a nice array of uh, interdisciplinary faculty as well as uh, students from you know, all different backgrounds who work there and um, can gain a lot of knowledge from the inter interdisciplinary aspect of, of the lab. So one of the great things about working here, specifically in the environmental lab at Vanderbilt, is our advanced thermal characterization capabilities. Uh, for example, we have a um, simultaneous DSC TGA mass spec. So that allows us to uh, link the chemical functional group um, properties to the mechanical characteristics of these natural organic matter, uh, which then let us understand the mechanisms of uh, absorption, desorption, um, those kind of things. The reasons I chose Vanderbilt, uh, there are quite a few. Um, one is the ease at which um, one can do inter interdisciplinary research. Um, I commonly work with uh, people from you know, biomolecular engineering as well as chemistry, chemical engineering. Um, and it's just there's a very nice um, ease of flow uh, between the departments. Uh, I've used equipment from uh, all different departments and also consulted with faculty from, from many departments as well as uh, Vanderbilt itself, I mean, the, the class size, ease of access of faculty members, um, and as well as, I mean, you can't even forget about Nashville. I mean, the city itself is also uh, very entertaining and very fun, so that's a big draw to Vanderbilt.